Okay, YouTube family, we got to talk about this, and I got breaking news. I'm getting messages from everybody everywhere, and I'm not going too deep. We're going to start off this the right way and set a legend. I apologize. I took almost a day off. I got situations to handle and priorities to take care of, but I've been on this nonstop. I've been driving. I think I went to... um. Wait, wait, I forgot which area in Alabama it was, Georgia and Florida, back and forth in them three states, nonstop. And I just been getting messages in my DMs and a lot. First of all, listen, Fifth Ward is going brazy. Fifth Ward is letting folks know, bro, like they want smoke, unfortunately. Now, I try to prevent certain drama. You got people in the fifth ward a lot don't like little Cam and a lot like him. I'll tell you about those who don't like him on the next video. Let's talk about folks who really want to see at a Atlanta houston war i've been talking to both sides of the city texas and the, and the a houston and the a that is and the things i'm getting a lot of great people in atlanta don't really want beef and a lot of the younger ones they don't care about none of this mob tie situation what's going on with j prince j prince jr jazz or any of they goons from anywhere folks is like they need get back and not in the way you might be thinking but they want to see something happen but little cam has been everywhere just talking throwing people off in the situation now you all know allegedly people was bringing up that cam was going to turn himself in not turn himself in turn himself in he's just been trolling everybody in the entire situation because they find this a funny one i doubted anybody in this gave a damn about takeoff anybody in this was thinking about the families the ramifications that's going to happen because we've seen it now several videos been posted on social media a lot of them i can't post here at all probably get me damn near indicted but dudes are, are locking in and loading up and getting ready now this guy little cam people claim that he's not the killer then he is the killer now i'm not saying nothing if he's the killer or not but the way he's been instigating as if you're making mockery of one of the guys who just died aka takeoff and what about the innocent people who are hurt as well so you're making mockery of the situation little cam aka big cam is letting the world know hey man come with it i don't care bro and you're showing everybody so when we see little cam left with jay prince allegedly i'm gonna say when we let's just do it this way when we seen jay prince walk past the body of takeoff for a lot of people it was set in stone already folks in them all right i see what it is now and i'm not gonna even tell you what they think because y'all pretty much know we seen the likes of shakur stevenson out here with the fake love but everybody know he's mob ties everybody were saying shakur stevenson was the one who punched Quavo now I don't know how true that is but a lot of people were saying that and they're trying to say he was one of the people who instigated it we'll do it on a separate video because we're on a little cam right now and before I keep going with this I need y'all to do me one favor man smash that like button hit that notification bell and come rock out here with I smoke hip hop live we've been giving you unadulterated cutting edge videos and updates and, and things personally that was spoken about so we just want you to give us our kudos salute the i smoke hip-hop nation i am going to go full throttle i am not taking no more breaks well it was only eight hour break but we'll continue going for everybody who's been updated i see our messages now little cam aka killer cam is making his presence felt everybody was blaming multiple people involved now so everybody think it's like one big huge conspiracy they was blaming mike prince if you don't know who's mike prince he's the one folks in him was like with the chucky bag him and his sons his sons got deals in the industry i don't know how true that is but we covered that already go watch our groundbreaking videos but everybody that's probably has anything to do with mob ties is being accused at this point if you show any affiliation you're guilty if you move out about you're guilty and i think it's warranted and it's fair for mob now to get the backlash because when this thing first popped off 
everybody was blaming Migo Bands. Everybody said he's guilty, but the cops just said only he's the person of interest. I guarantee you the cops made Migo Bands the purchase of interest because they think since he lost takeoff, rest in peace to take off, that he probably would have given them information to arrest dudes part of mob ties let's just be real and migo bands is a street dude he's a thorough dude i doubt it he'll give them any info to get anybody in trouble because they're gonna keep it where it needs to be at in the streets now if you're a civilian and you want to see judge get involved police get involved you already know now little cam aka big cam i don't know if he pulled the trigger or not but what i do know he has no sympathy for takeoff or the migos he's been talking non-stop where everybody thought he died i'm glad i made them videos where i told you i doubt it he's dead but i'll report the news since everybody's talking about it but i made sure to tell y'all regardless if he's dead or not folks are blaming you so if anybody who's connected to the migos or atlanta or even if it's your ops in houston who hates you folks they're coming for you because it was dudes from the fifth ward hitting me up and a lot of your ops little cam aka big cam they don't like you bro they want you out the way and they already painted the narrative to stain you i'm gonna just tell you the truth so when you post these type of posts look like you want that smoke too so it is what it is now people use this description to paint the narrative on Migo bands if you don't know this was the narrative people followed and watched it all through and through i tried to look at it and distinguish uh, distinguish uh, distinguish maybe i can't pronounce for nothing but and look at it what was the situation we watched the video all he did was clutch and he had it on him if you are in a state that allows weapons like what migo bands had then you would know a majority of the citizens you walk around are doing the same thing migo band does when you're in a situation and you have to stand your ground and protect yourself he did nothing wrong so for little cam to come out and about and say the claims he's saying and now this is his own folks who are calling little cam a snitch i'm just being honest i'm not putting that jacket on nobody but clearly the folks who are around your communities little cam they've placed the jacket on you the suit and tie on you and everything you can place in a casket or outside a casket in church of you being an alleged rat i don't know how they came up with that i don't know who you are to say this is facts so i'm not gonna do that but we're gonna present the news since you guys like being celebrities and superstars and having no heart nor compassion for each other you don't see one post from the mob besides jay prince you feel me apologizing or at least you don't have to apologize if you don't want to get in trouble by the law but at least saying we are sorry for the loss of takeoff the fact that j prince jr didn't even say we miss you or anything i'm sorry j prince jr i got no issues with you but i understand why the world don't like you right now don't like your partners in them right now because i think you're going out your way to clearly show us you don't rock with anybody in the migos and you want to see it get finito man it's unfortunate to see situations like that it's unfortunate for it to you know go to the place where it meets the end of the earth but little cam they coming for you folks and you probably innocent but i think instead of acting like this big bod gangster man speak up on the situation let people know your heart is in the right place but i doubt it so it is what it is with these type of individuals look man i'm your guy dj bless one i got 20 videos to give y'all updates on there's no way i can put everything in one video then the video will be an hour long and let's just be real a lot of your attention spans ain't that long so to anybody which really nobody asks me that but to the one percent ask why don't you just put everything in one video because it's too much information now you have a blessed day love your family love your kids stay blessed i am dj bless one salute the i smoke hip-hop nation appreciate all of y'all keep this thing going have this thing booming out here trust me we booming as far as covering the news love your family love your kids and always remember man always remember stay blessed out here you hear me blessings to the kings and the queens